Welcome back PMCs, today we are diving into the escape from Tarkov task BP Depot. Praypor is running a little bit low on fuel, so he wants us to mark four tankers that they are trying to acquire. Sounds pretty straightforward, but Customs has a tendency to get chaotic pretty quickly. So let's get into it and make this task a little bit easier for you. You will need four MS-2000 markers to place on each of the fuel tankers, which thankfully Praypor is willing to give us to get us started. What a stand-up guy, right? These can be placed both in your special slot or in your security container so there's no reason you should lose them. Generally speaking I do recommend trying to get this task done in one go since it only takes a little bit of backtracking which is kind of rare for a four marker task but if you have other tasks to do on customs which you know are going to take you more than one raid such as Operation Aquarius Part 2 or something like that there's really no reason to force this and bring all four at the same time. The tankers are in the four following locations. Uh, the first being the new gas station. The first marking point can be found around the back of the tanker and if you're coming from the crossroads spawn you'll have to go through the left side of the station or jump over the barbed wire but be careful the scab boss Rashala can spawn here at the gas station so keep your eyes peeled for him and his bodyguards and if he's there obviously you've got a tough fight on your hands. The second tanker is located in the construction site and it is the exact same tanker you retrieved the bronze pocket watch from so you should be relatively familiar with this area. The third tanker is located at the old gas station just south of the building. A handful of scavs can spawn here so don't just run in there unprepared and it's also a potentially an active extract for anyone coming from the east side of the map so be mindful if you see green smoke or just expect players to come and check it. The fourth and final tanker is directly Directly south of the crossroads extract outside the southwest side of storage. If you're lucky and spawn on the east end of the map, you could be very close to this tanker giving you a nice head start, but players can also spawn on both sides of this tanker in each corner of the map, so be careful when planting right here, especially right after spawning. If you're wanting to get the BP Depot quest done as quickly as possible, you can pretty easily do it in one raid with these two routes. The route you take depends on which side of customs you spawn on, but both are pretty easy to follow. And always keep in mind on customs that the general flow in most of the map is very much in an east or west direction. So when you're running north and south, you need to be aware that you might be intersecting a player's rotation. And of course, that makes you more susceptible to being in a firing lane. And as always with customs, be careful around the natural choke points of the map. Get it done in one pass. If you spawn on the west side of the map, you'll want to hit old gas first and then move to new gas, preferably using the jump over near the factory shortcut door or the key to avoid backtracking too much down the fence line towards the checkpoint. Be sure you look over the fence before you jump because Rashala or a player can make pretty short work of you as you come over the fence if you're not careful. After new gas, you'll head to construction and then finally across the bridges to trailer park tanker on the east end of the map and then extract. If you spawn on the east end, you simply reverse this pattern, except for you can't really jump over the wall, you have to go through the factory shortcut, or you just have to go down to one of the two holes in the fence prior to getting to the old gas tank. The key is just to save the old gas marker for last since it has a relatively decent chance to be your extract. And that pretty much rounds off our guide for the BP Depot quest. Follow these tips, stay sharp, and you'll get through it. If this guide helped you, you know what to do. Thank you for watching, and stay safe out there. Peace.